Welcome back to the MSU Federal Credit Union Coaches Show. One of the most remarkable parts of the turnaround the Michigan State women's basketball program has had this season is they have largely done it with players who were on the team last season. Of the seven players who were averaging over 20 minutes a game this season, six were on the team last season, which includes Julia Aralt, who is the team's leading scorer at just under 15 points per game. Our Tyler Driesinga was able to catch up with her this week and has more on our journey to East Lansing and a position change that has led to a career year. It's been a long road for Julia Aralt to become the player we've seen this season, a player brimming with confidence and impacting the game on both ends. Aralt is a fifth year senior who missed the entirety of her junior season with a left foot injury. I remember kind of days following, you know, you kind of feel like the game can be taken away from you in a split second. I mean, blink of an eye and you're out for a season. I think like a lot of times we take that for granted and that was something for me with last year and this year is like, I'm just grateful to be back out there. Aralt returned to the court to play in every game last season, but her minutes were limited, and she says it took a long time to feel like her old self. For the majority of that year I got back, I definitely had a tough time just like trusting it and trusting like I can still do the things I did before and just kind of learning that and learning that mental piece. I think that was something that it took me a long time to kind of get back into the game and feeling like I normally do. After spending last season learning to trust herself, she spent this off season learning to trust the program's new head coach, Robin Fralick. First meeting we ever had with her, she was like, I just want to get to know you guys as people. And I think that was something that really stood out to me just because she really placed like a huge priority on her relationships with each and every one of us. And I think the better relationship you have with your coach, your coaching staff, the easier it is to kind of trust them on and off the floor. What has Coach Freilich taught you this year that you'll carry into life beyond basketball? Oh, she taught me a lot of things. Um, honestly, the relationship piece. She has been so like good to all of us, so welcoming to all of us, and I think like she's really taken a ton of time out of her like time and her day to really get to know each of us. That's something that is really important to me, but I think it's enhanced that and just like shown me how important it is to just take every moment you have with people and just kind of like really learn about them, get to know them, and just better your relationship. During the summer, Freilich approached Aralt about playing center. Aralt says the trust Freilich had built with her provided assurance the position change was in her best interest. You know, when she asked me if I would want to play more five, I was like, she thinks this is going to be good for me and for the team, so there's no reason for me not to trust it and trust that they're going to help me in any way that they can to be successful. The shift to center has led Aral to blossom into the player we've seen this season, a driving force in the Spartan turnaround who's averaging career highs across the board. What role has confidence played in your in your basketball career and in this year specifically? I think confidence is it's it's a huge part of basketball. Like I definitely had some struggles with that last season. I think I. I was probably the least confident I'd been in a long time just from coming off of injury and just kind of, like I mentioned earlier, like trusting trusting yourself, trusting your body again. And I think this year, like, obviously confidence comes within yourself, but also like just the confidence the staff gives us. I mean, they, they believe in us with their whole hearts and they, they really just trust each of us and they trust each of our abilities. And I think that's helped me to just like enhance my own confidence and kind of believe in myself. Is this recent stretch the most confident that you've felt as a college basketball player? Um, probably. I think the people I'm playing with make that really easy because they're just, everyone is just really, really like good and present in what our team is doing. And I think, I mean, I know we have like four or five people averaging double figures now, which is like, it's amazing. Like it makes you really hard to beat and I think with confident people around you, it's kind of hard to not kind of follow suit and want to be good, want to be good for them as well. You've only got a month or so left of, of college basketball. What legacy do you hope to leave within the MSU women's basketball program? Probably just like staying the course. A lot of times, it's very, especially right now, like the transfer portal is a big thing and that was something that like I never like wanted to be a part of and I think like there's obviously good reasons why people should get in the transfer portal. but. 
I think just like staying the course, believing in a place, believing in the people that you're around and just kind of like trusting that this is where you're meant to be for a reason. And I think that's something that's been really important to me and kind of just, I love Michigan State. I love everything about it. So just being here and loving a place, loving the people, that would be it. A. Ralt has been a real force on the defensive end for the Spartans this year as well. She leads the team with just over seven rebounds per game and her 58 blocks this season not only leads the team, but she is the only player on the roster with double figure blocks. How about that? We need to take one quick break. When we come back, we're going to shift over to the men's basketball team to feature one of the more exciting players on Tommy Zell's roster. This segment is sponsored by MSU Healthcare. 